What's up, people, and welcome to the Mortuary Assistant. Since I haven't made a video in two months, three months, figure I'll do something that'll probably give me nightmares. Oh, warning. What you're about to experience is based on real paranormal events. Research of the occult has shown that heightened movements of emotions such as fear can encourage the manifestation of hauntings. If, after playing this game, you experience abnormal happenings around your home or have sudden changes in the behavior of yourself or loved ones, reach out immediately to your local church of paranormal investigators. Okay, yeah, no. Uh, let's see. V-Sync is on. Resolution's fine. Quality's ultra. Uh, sprint. Quick inventory. Gurney? Use, close. Alright. New ship. I played the demo of this, like, two years ago? A year and a half ago? And now they actually released a full game? And I mean... The demo was scary as I'm shit. I'm so glad it's almost over. Congratulations, sweetie. <laughs> Thank you. I'll never Connecting. understand why you chose such a macabre feel. There's nothing oh, disturbing lady. about it. It's just but that I... am proud of you. I really am. You've come so far. I have. So, you haven't told me what's next. Will you get a job where you are, or...? They actually have everyone they need. But my old teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to finalize my internship there. Oh. oh, well, that's good. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? <laughs> no. No, I'm not moving. He's actually located around here. River Fields. Oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma. Even I've heard Grandma. things about that place. I'd just be worried people about it. Uh, make up She's stories. Like 800 years old. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. All right, all right. I'm sorry. But I wanted to give you this anyway. So, here. Is it money? Oh. Yeah, I'll probably be helpful. I, I don't know if I want that. Yeah, you Just do. Just take it, please. I want it. It should be yours anyway. Thanks. What? All right. Enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When do you start? I've now. actually been there for a few weeks now. My review is tomorrow. Okay. Game saves automatically, uh, as it should. You've reached a checkpoint whenever you see this icon, whatever the hell that is. Looks like a sewing needle. With hands. Alright, here we go. Yeah, here we go. What are we doing? Coffee. Oh! Uh, uh, oh, it's one of those. Okay, so I can... Do that right here. And Alright, that's not a Keurig. So I can... Yep, set that right there. And then... There we go. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's how you make coffee. Can I leave? No, can't leave. Can pick this up. Yoink! Oh. <laughs> At least the physics are real. With the indestructible vases. It's uh. Huh! Nope. All right, we're gonna put this back. Oh god. We're gonna put this back. Right. Just how we left it. There we go. Toilet paper, flush the toilet, turn the water on. We got a oh, breaker box of some sort. Close that. Uh, turn that off. That's not creepy at all. Oh, okay, so right click does something. What is this? Got staples. Nope, nothing in there. Nothing in there. 
it in there. We got a pencil. Use to sign the paperwork left on the door. Uh, quick inventory. Okay. Paperwork left on the door. What door? Oh, this door. Rebecca, one last thing I forgot to give you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign. Thanks. Pencil? Is that what I was supposed to say? Okay. That's not creepy at all. We're going to shut that door. Rebecca. Oh! Great. Perfect timing. Okay, hi. I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. Moving the deceased. Use the gurney by standing behind it and pressing the gurney interact key. Then walk backwards with the gurney down the hall. Okay. Uh, get right here. Okay, dead guy, you're coming with me. Please don't wake up. Bring the body in or out of cold storage up in the bay with the body's name. Pull out the rack and move the cart over it. Okay. Uh, Dalton. How? Okay. Oh, there we go. All right. And now, uh, how do I? How do I turn? Oh, okay. That, that's how that works. Uh, Alright, move this right here. Okay. You go back in there. Shut that. Open that. Alright. Alright. Dead lady on the gurney. Okay. Close that. Now, how do I, how do I turn? Oh, I see. I gotta. All right, I need to up my sensitivity here. There we go. All right. Don't worry, lady. You'll be just fine. All right. I'm just finishing up something here, so why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks. Okay. I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. Clipboard used for forms and keeping track of mortuary tasks. Okay. You clipboard. Dorothy Page, 87. Record any distinguishing marks. Enter marks into computer and print. Okay. So now what? Inspect body. Uh, how do I rotate? Oh, I see. Oh, right there. There's a mole and some scratches. Uh, what about feet? Just got a mole right there. What? Hmm. These old windows never stay latched. Mole on her foot. Uh, some freckles or something? Nope. Nothing there. Uh, why won't it let me? Oh, I guess I already found those. Okay. Face. Just got something there. Uh, lifeless eyes. That's interesting. Okay, we're gonna rotate there. All right, I think we're good. Not abrasion ball, ball, left arm ball. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, now what? But the computer's locked. What is he doing? He's just writing nothing. What an idiot. Uh, what, where? I thought I got everything. 
I guess I, I missed something? I don't see... There's nothing... I already got that one. Right arm, left arm. Oh, did I not do the other arm? Oh, there we go. Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Don't forget to take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. Yeah, After okay. that, we'll get started. Move. Enter cadaver information. Click the record system icon to open the program. Whoa, what? What was that? I didn't say anything. You all right? Y yeah, I'm fine. Sorry. Oh, okay. Head, mole. Left shoulder, nothing. Right shoulder, that. Uh, name, fourth page, age, 87. Uh, left leg, mole. Left arm, nothing. Right arm, blemishes. Right leg, mole. Submit. Piece of paper. Packet of mortuary paper related to the handling of the deceased file up front so they are available if requested. Okay. What? Why are there glowing footprints? Okay. Uh. What? It's not letting me do it. What the hell? Oh, maybe, do I have, to, oh, I have to actually. Time to embalm. Yeah, time to embalm. All right, I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Everything's on your list there if you need it. All right, wire jaw shut with needle injector and settings needles. Okay, what the fuck is a needle injector? Needle injector. Mm. Moisturizing wipe. Oh, setting needles. Bars with the length of wire used with needle injector to wire jar shut. Okay. Give me that. Needle injector. Okay. Wire jar shut. Okay. Click on. Pull the manipulator up and press the inject. Uh, okay. Oh. All right. Now what? It does nothing. Oh, s setting needles. I can't use that here. I can't use that here. What? That's what I'm using. Oh! Oh, Jesus! I can't use that here. What the hell? Oh! Oh, I get it. Alright. That's easy enough. We're just gonna... Perform some minor surgery here on this dead lady. Alright. Uh, there you go. Alright. There we go. Hey! She's not smiling anymore. Insert eye caps to keep eyes shut. Okay. Eye caps. Alright. Alright. I got the hang of this now. Play, use a manipulator to open the eyelid completely. Interact with the eye to play. Okay. So, oh, no, that needs to go up. That needs to go up. Or, no, we need to close the eyes. Oh, no. Okay, eyes. There. All right. Uh, mix embalming fluid and pump. Glutaralahyde, methanol, humectant, formaldehyde. Okay, fine. I'm gonna open that. Uh, uh, you know what? Methanol. I can't hold anything else. Oh, okay. 
close. I can't hold anything else. No, I get it. I can't hold it. Oh, god damn it. Drop. Anything else? Alright, give me that. Whoa, what the? Hmm. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly. Oh. And it can make them pop. Sure. Yeah, whatever. Like that. Just keep doing your thing. I'll get it. Yeah, whatever. Pour that in there. Uh, I need that. Alright. Give me that. Hey! Making a decision in the carotid artery and jugular vein with scalpel. Alright, give me the scalpel. Alright. Uh, pretty sure I need to be on the other side to slice this lady's neck open. There we go! Oh! He's directly on the way. Use a quick inventory. See if we have needed. Okay. Uh. Oops. With fuse forceps to clamp tubing to both veins and connect the involving pump. Okay. Forceps. Tubing. Uh, I'm gonna take that too. I can't hold anything else. I can't hold anything else. Okay, fine. Uh, let's see here. Go back to dead lady. Forceps. Tubing. Gauge pump, alright. <laughs> Not gross at all. Alright, so I gotta wait till the old lady uh, runs out of body food. There we go. She's out of juice. Now what? Oops. Uh, turn off pump, remove tubes, close incision. Alright. There, remove tubes. Close incision. Alright. Fill an empty IV reservoir bag with cavity fluid. Then insert trocar into the... Oh, okay. Uh, what, what was that? I'm just gonna close that. Uh, I need that. I need that. Fill with cavity fluid. Okay. I'm missing something. Search your car until it stops to begin the flow. Uh. I can't use that here. What? That's what it told me to do. Fill an empty IV reservoir bag with cav oh cavity fluid. All right, what what's cavity fluid? Um, is it this stuff? No. Ah, cavity fluid. All right. All right. All right, lady. Oh, that's so gross. I can smell the demonetization right now. Mix cleaners and bathroom closet to create tank cleaner, then pour into the embalming pump. Uh, okay. Sure. Uh, 
Uh, I need that. And I need that. I can't hold anything else. I can't hold anything oh, else. God dang it. Next cleaner is about to close a great tank cleaner. Then pour into the embalming pump. Okay. I can't I can't use that here. Uh, well then how do I get rid of it? Drop. Okay. I already have one of those. Uh, of course I do. Uh, okay, we're gonna drop some more. What is this? That's the same stuff. It's all tank cleaner. What? Can I not take this with? That's not it. What? I can't use that. Here. Am I supposed? I don't get it. Mix cleaners and bathroom closet to create tank cleaner and pour into the embalming pump. All right. You know what? I don't believe in leaving doors open. Shut that door. Uh. Am I missing something that I need here? Do I need this? Nope. Close that. Bro, help! I hate this job. All right, I did. Something's not right here. Oh, it gave it to me. All right, I'm dumb. All right, Grandma. Time to pump tank cleaner into you. He doesn't move, like at all. All right, a moisturizing pad thing, okay. Moisturize face, okay, yeah, there we go. We're just gonna, whoa! What the Tell hell what. kind of moisturizer was that? What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Uh, are you sure? No, I just I'm not got done. Here. Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. But... Okay. You know, just for that, I'm gonna leave all the windows open so this man gets possessed. Go ahead. It's fine. I'll give you a call when you get some windows. Shut up! It was just really weird. So some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. No, I know. It, it wasn't even my fault. But it is a big deal. But he sent me home right after that. I'm just really worried. He was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said What the hell he is would, this apartment? Right? Not like yeah. a Ikea so dresser. That's a good thing. TV from Yeah. It just didn't feel like he coffee. meant it. Like, like he Michael just said it to get me floor. out of the building. Uh, wait a sec, I have another call. Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. I'm just not feeling too well. 
Told you. He's That's possessed. That's actually why I'm calling. I know it's late, but we just got three new cadavers, and no one else can make it in right now. I was hoping you could come in and take care of them. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I mean, of course. <laughs> Great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. <gasps> see? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. I have to go. Like, right now. I'll talk to you later. Where are my keys? All right, let's go. Demonic position where, time. Where are my keys? God, I always lose those. Are you there? Uh, okay. It was in the toothpaste all along. Nope. Where the hell did you put the keys? Wait, hold on. Music band shirt. That's... Where the hell are the keys? I'm Mr. Oh, keys. No. No, we're not. All right. Open door. Oh, shut the door. All right. I guess I'll head to the back and get started. Uh, what? What's that? Hello? Hi, Rebecca. M Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just try to stay calm. I know you're scared. I'll unlock the door in a moment. What? This is very sudden, but listen to me. We have to start right away. I'm sorry. Oh, he didn't locked know me in. Until it made itself known this morning that it was here, let alone bound to you. I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You need to act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll, I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's uh -oh. far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm, okay? We embalm, file the paperwork, everything. Treat it like a normal day. Okay, Staying cool. Staying focused will help. I left some things for you on the desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. No, wait. Ugh. Damn it, what the fuck? This is insane. Okay. This is so stupid. Just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just, Wait, where'd he go? Just play along and do your job. Uh, alright. Open the box. Tape recorder. Hold key. Hall key. Okay. Hall key. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and open that door too. Can quit it tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? All right. All right. Listen carefully. I'm look. I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, but I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, 
You will need to learn the demon's name, bind it to its chosen body, and burn it in the retort. What? <sighs> Look, I know this is a lot to take in. I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. <laughs> I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that having a physical object with a known message will help you stay grounded. I won't be calling again. You can't trust the phones. Anything can be manipulated. Okay. Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. The most important thing in the room is in that cabinet. Open it up. Good luck, Rebecca. I'm sorry this had to happen. All right, we got this. This is insane. Come on. Whatever. Get Just the tape. Be the professional one. Grab Stop talking. And get the tape. Get started. There we go. The night shift database. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. Yes. The database Screw. contains oh, all the information on the process of expulsion, work. the tools used, and most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. You will need this information. My Whatever. ID card is in my Just personal belongings. Grab a body and get started. The passcode to access it. Use it. Whatever. Just oh, grab a body okay. and get started. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you, until you are unable to resist. Identifying a demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Look carefully. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. At least I can keep track of things. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body, with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Forget it. Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder and burn, you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They can be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture. Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them, so check regularly. Once you uncover the oh. sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with, and use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. Add the reagent to the embalming mixture, uncover the sigils, build the mark and place it on the body. Then, when you're certain, burn it in the retort. All right, that's not terrifying at all. Where's the... You know what? Screw this. I'm calling the police. Fuck. All right, I got this. Not even remotely terrified right now. 
Let's see who we got here. Yeah, Laverne, Lashonda, Johnson, Lashonda. It is. But how do I know which one I'm supposed to do first? It's fine. Don't worry, lady. Uh, it won't let me. Oh! Where is it at? Okay, so there's the mark there. Maybe I should do that first. Another one of them things. Let's see. I already found one mark. Let's see if there's anything else around here. Uh, the creepy picture. That's fine. All right. So one mark. I just gotta do my job and they won't let me there it goes okay thank you all right lady off you go It's fine. All right, let's check you out. All right, so now we gotta look at the. Oh wait, rotate. Nothing. Oh Jesus Christ! All right, that's fine. Hello? Oh, she's awake. Nope, nope. New job. I'm getting out of here. All right, now she got a mark on the legs. Pretty sure that wasn't there before. Screw this. I'm getting back to work. Yep. So stupid. Got something there. Nothing there. Uh. Got a mark there. Gotta look at the head now. That, that I don't want to. There we go. Nothing there. There's a scratch there, but some sort of suture. All right. All right, now we gotta do this thing. Wait, where was the code? I didn't hear what the, the code was. Record system. What the? Look. The night shift database. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. The database contains all the information on the process of expulsion, the tools used, and most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the Puzzle. What's the password? You will need this information. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Oh, personal it. belongings Use drawer. It. Where the... What? The hell is the personal belongings drawer? Aha! Uh... 
That's not what I needed, but okay. Let's see, personal belongings drawer. Personal belongings drawer. Uh, I didn't mean to do that, whatever it was. Let's see, personal belongings drawer. this drawer I don't know what that was I'm not gonna look so we got one symbol already where the hell is this stupid drawer it's got to be in here personal belongings drawer. This? Large old key. Okay, cool. Aha! Oh, that's mine. Alright. There we go. April 17th, 1944. 8831. Alright, cool. Hatch outside. Okay, that's fine. Oh, the lights are off now. Okay. Nope. Eight, eight, three, one. There we go. Do I want to play this? Alright. This... working? Yeah. This thing is huge. So, uh... I guess... Um... This is David. Raymond, this feels insane, but... I think you were right. This has happened a few times now, but... Let me see if I can... get in here. His feet moved. There it is. Fuck. I mean, old girl sat straight up, so that's a thing. Record system. Name. Age. Head. Mole. Right shoulder. Contusion. Right arm. Okay, the lights are going out. That's fine. Left leg. No, that left leg. Mild abrasion. Okay, submit. What? I did. I did that already. Mild abrasion. Submit. Okay. Give me the paper. Give me the paper. I need to file the copy up front. Oh, the lights are back on. That's awesome. Uh, 
it's time to embalm. Oh, so I already... Oh, I did it already. Okay. Alright. Okay, no worries. I can do this. She doesn't have any new identifying marks. I don't think. Uh, wire jaw, needle injector, setting needles. Okay. Where's the needle injector? That's moisturizer. It's a syringe. Maldehyde. Oh, here we go. Alright. Here we go. One of those. One of those. All right, lady. Don't mind me. Just gonna wire your jaw shut. This isn't fun for me either. There we go. Okay. Jaw shut. Alright, so the symbol is a uh, H with some little circles on it. What was that? Oh, okay, so that one has the little symbols. Okay. So does that one. Alright, so something tells me that I'm not gonna have. What is. Alright. Insert eye caps. Alright, where the hell are the eye caps? Eye caps. We're gonna close those. Eye caps. Okay. No, oh, it's fine. It's fine. All right. Aha. Uh. Uh. Oh. No. no. All right. I'm coming to get you, lady. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. I'm not even bothered. Oh, I could have just escaped out the back. So that's a thing. All right. All right, you. There's nothing catching on fire. Surprisingly. I've only got one symbol. Oh! What was that? Where are you at? I know you're in here. Where is it? What? It's gotta be like right here somewhere. Oh, it's up there. So now it's the H with the circle thingies and a weird looking... UL. H with circle things in the UL. There's 
It's not one of those. H circle thingy. Nope. Aha! I bet it's this guy right here. Mix embalming fluid and pump. Uh, glue Pluto, whatchamacallit, hi. Uh, hello? How do I know which one's which? It's this guy. It's the only one that has that, both of those, I think. Oh, nope, it could be this guy too. Oh, or that guy. Oh, damn it. So, can I... Can I put this in there? Okay. Can't hold anything else. Damn it. Okay, that wasn't creepy. Gluta, gluta, raldehyde. Gluta, raldehyde, okay. Where's gluta, raldehyde? This stuff. Why wouldn't it let me do it? Oh. So, glued around to hide. Toss that in there, too. Glued around to hide. Formaldehyde, yep. Methanol and humectant. Okay. Then all. You nicked it. Okay. Scalpel. Okay. Uh, forceps. Forceps. Where's the tubing? I need tubing. Tubing? Uh, where the hell is the tubing? Tubing! Ha! Forceps. Tubing. All right, lady. No hard feelings.
Nailed it. Alright. Take that. Close that up. Who said that? IV reservoir bag thing here. That goes with that. And then I need one of these. Let's just see if I got another letter somewhere. Oh, the doors are open now. That's awesome. So I can leave, right? I'm out! Or not. Alright, so no more... No more name. Empty IV reservoir bag, okay. It's cool. Only well, we got two bodies to do. There we go. All right, all good. next uh, cleaners in the bathroom all right where's the the notepad thing Not answering that phone call. No, sir. I'm not answering that. You keep ringing. Not today, Satan. Moisturizers. There we go. Alright, we're gonna make you look pretty. Okay, get the eyeballs. Get that. Get the nose. Right. Turn body to cold storage. Oh, uh, away we go. Aha! Easy peasy. where you go. Yep. I'm gonna grab this thing. Alright. And... Nope. Get in there. There we go. Alright. Who's next? Uh, Laverne. Johnson Woods. That's a fun name. Alright, buddy. Come with me. Okay, the lights are flickering again. Alright. Shut that door. Grab this guy. Roll him down the hall.
Okay. Let's get a look at you. Oh, he's got scratches on his face. I bet you he's the, uh, the demonic vessel thing. He's got marks on him. Yeah, he's got marks all over him. Bet this is the guy. There we go. Aha! Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay. That was a thing in the cabinet. Yep, we're gonna not leave cabinets open anymore. Ever. Okay, uh, we can close that out. That was terrifying. Uh, right arm has blemishes. Right shoulder didn't have anything. Left leg had something. Oh, that was that. Left leg, uh, left arm, rash. Aha! Get fucked, demon. Alright, I got that. Okay. Got the embalming report right there. Still nothing catching on fire, so I... I would have thought it would have been in that hallway. Alright, now we gotta wire his jaw shut again. So I need one of them. One of those. I'm just gonna do this. Okay. We're almost done, buddy. There we go. So, uh, 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 uh. There we go. Hey. Insert eye caps. Okay, where were the eye caps? Eye caps were. There we go. Hey, calm down. Calm down. I knew it. It's this guy. It has to be this guy. You get one? You get one? All right. That. Uh, embalming fluid. All right. Got this. We got the glutaraldehyde. Got a bottle of our magic juice. Uh, whatever that is. Uh, whatever this is. And some of that. And away you go. Right? Oh no. Wait. I need that. I need that. Uh, the tubing is in the, the in the drawer that the demon's living in. I thought. What 
is this? Where's the tubing? I thought I knew what the tubing was. Okay, I lost it. I don't know where the tubing is. Huh. Uh, if I were tubing, where would I be? In here? Where is the tubing? Damn it. Oh god, now what? It's right there. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, Jesus Christ, there was the, the ring girl under the cabinet. That's awesome. That's great. Very cool. It's fine. Okay. Uh, forceps. Uh, tubing. Alright. Time to pump you full of god juice. <laughs> Pump removes tubes. Okay, cool. Tubes. Uh, shut you back up. There we go. IV reservoir bag. Now that I'm about to have a coronary, it's fine. Alright, I need one of them things. Okay, cool. Alright, buddy. Nothing personal. Rebecca? Uh, no. Nope. I'm gonna keep doing my job. Come on. Rebecca, come here. Come here now. No! God damn it. It's gonna make me do this. Mom. You stupid bitch. Hate me all you want. He's dead because of you. I wasn't even done you yet. You should be the one here. Oh, okay. Lifeless. Lifeless. It's fine. Oh, Jesus. All right. That's, that was awesome. Okay. All right, buddy. We're going to figure your name out here real quick. He doesn't have anything on him. It didn't say that the thing would catch on fire like outside. Huh. Uh, where were we? Alright. Right up into his lungs. Mix cleaners and bathroom. 
Got it. Oh, oh. Oh, where you at? Aha! Wait, where is it? Alright, I gotta go grab another one. But where is the deal? Is it there? No. Oh, we gotta turn those back on. It's gotta be like right here somewhere. Oh, okay, so now we got the H, the UL thingy, and a L dot. was not cool. This is not a good game. It literally make it look like the demon from the exorcist. That's awesome. All right, we can close this. Let's see if we can pinpoint our friend here. All right, so we have the H that and the L dot. So it's this guy. I think. I don't see any of the other ones that have it. H, L, thingy, weird, U. Oh yeah, you're screwed, buddy. It's this guy. So H, L dot on the bottom, U L on the left, and whatever the Z is. H. Uh, okay, I got that. I already forgot what it was. H L U Z. H L U Z thing. I can't hold anything else. Why not? I just got it right. It's him. Oh, fine. Mix cleaners and bathroom, tank cleaner. But he doesn't have the mark on his body, so it's not him. Or if it is him, then he's not displaying signs. It said that the mark would be on his body. He also hasn't got up and started dancing yet, so that's fortuitous. Eh, we're just going to clean you up a little bit. All right. Don't wake up. All right, he's done. Away we go. Let's go. Time for you to go back in the refrigerator. It was this guy, right? Yeah, there we go. Which leaves you. You are the demon. Via process of elimination. Oh, okay, cool. I think. Unless, like, I have to look at the body. 
see if there's a symbol on her. Oh, whatever. Alright, friend. Distinguishing marks. We got some bruising. And what appears to be some sort of demonic possessioning. It's not him. It's got to be one of them. Like he's... None of them have, like... Displayed the... The... Whatchamacallit? The, the name. Entry number three. Laverne Ross, age 35, head contusion, left shoulder contusion, left leg nothing, left arm contusion, right arm contusion, right leg contusion. What, what did I miss? Left shoulder, right shoulder, left leg, nothing, right left arm. Contusion, right arm, contusion, right leg. What the fuck did I miss? It doesn't have any marks. There we go. Oh, he did have a scratch on him. Okay, cool. Right shoulder, mild abrasion. Submit. Let's do this! I can't hold anything else. Alright, so... Okay. The, the demon is... Well, I mean, I already know what the demon's name is. Oh, it put the vase back. That's awesome. Uh, okay. Uh, calm down. Gotta staple you shut real quick so I can burn your body and exercise the demon. There we go. Eye caps. Alright, eye caps. Get that. Get that. Figure out one of these. Okay. Alright, buddy. Uh, eye caps. Caps. There we go. Okay. All right. And bombing fluid. All right. Uh, we know we need this. I can't. I can't use that here. Yes, we can. There we go. Got that. Okay. Go fuck yourself. 
Hey, whoa, whoa, you can't leave. No, sir. Get back here. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not going in there. Nope. You can stay right over there. Uh, it's gonna make me do it. It's gonna make me do it. Come on. Where did you go? No! I'm not going! Hey you! Please! Don't! I hurt you so much. I don't care about anything anymore. I don't want to be here without you. Please. Okay. Just... I love you. Open. I guess. I don't know what the hell is happening anymore. Somebody! Get me out of here! They're gonna... They're gonna kill me! Stop me! Stop me! Stop me! Stop me! Uh... Okay. Go towards the light. Oh, no, you don't. Get back here. Oh. Necklace. Okay. Now what? <laughs> Demon! You should have died when you had the chance! <laughs> Be gone, Demon! <laughs> ha! Nice try. Oh, I forgot to put her back in the, in the closet. All right, buddy. Some more sticking around. Pretty sure I already got this right. Is it the Z thing? It is! I knew it! Yeah, you're fucked. Uh, what else do I need? Humectin. What the hell is the humectin? That. Alright, we're gonna chuck some of that in there. And go get a bottle of holy embalming fluid. Open this up, make sure my buddy's not living in there still. Alright, cool. Yeah, you're screwed. Me. 
Rebecca. It's your grandma. Oh, hell no. Get away, grandma. What are you doing in the rain? Fuck you. You're not coming in here. Get bent, grandma. Don't you love your grandma? Nope. Nope, I do not love you. I'm not letting you in. It's so cold out here. I have to come in. Let me in. No. Absolutely not. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Don't you miss me? I brought you something. Grandma's got a knife. I thought maybe you could slit your wrist for me. Just a little cut. Oh, what's wrong, Rebecca? <laughs> Back off, Grandma. <laughs> Don't be afraid of your grandma! No, 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 no. Get away! <laughs> Okay, cool. That's awesome. All right. I'm missing something. I bet you it's him. It's got to be him. I'm missing something. Oh, I didn't need that. I needed that. All right, homeboy. I can't. I can't use. I can't. I can't use that here. There we go. What the hell, man? So how do I know... I already got the demon's name. What do I do next? Uh, tap. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you, until you are unable to resist. Identifying a demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Look carefully. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, Bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. Oh, that's Pay where I screwed up. signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right. Okay. Oh yeah. Now that I actually listen to that, you're in deep shit, devil person. Are you sure this is the right one? Oh yeah, I'm sure.
Oh god damn it! Why does he keep doing that? Oh I'm yeah. Wrong, you know. Oh, I'm not wrong. You're getting burned, buddy. Yep, you're in deep trouble. It is you. I knew it was you. I can't I can't use that here. Oops, oops. It's him. It's absolutely him. Douchebag. Oh god, now what? Jesus Christ, alright. I'm gonna moisturize his face and then he's going in the incinerator. Sorry, buddy. Alright. Yep, it's you. It is absolutely you. Away we go! <laughs> yep, I knew it! Guess where you're going? You're going in here right now. In you go. Sayonara! Bye! Thank God. <laughs> what a dick. Good morning. It's nice not to be the one down there for a change. Uh, Raymond? Uh, I suppose a first name basis is in order. D did I make it? Is it over? For now. It's never really over. You've come a long way. It's a lot to learn. I'm so glad I'm here. I know it's disorienting. You'll get used to it. You should head home and get some rest. Every night can be different. I think I'm fine. Are you sure? You seem out of it. Oh, I've just been waiting for so, so long. What? What are you... Oh, no. You chose the wrong body. Rebecca. Rebecca's not here, you fucking <laughs> idiot! What? Worthless. Watch your foolish boy. And drink it as nuts from the pit of a frame. Oh. <laughs> okay, so I was wrong. Oh. Damn. Well, that sucks. I thought I had it right for sure. Alright, now that I've shortened my lifespan for a little while. Yeah, I'm going to have to try that again at some point when it's not going to give me a heart attack. But, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. Until next time, goodbye. Huh. <laughs>